This video is gonna be about my favorite warm-ups. I thought it would be a cool idea to do a bunch of them in one video. I feel like every guitar player needs uh, between 10 to 20 minutes to really feel warmed up. Unfortunately, the physical thing is real. It's not that I have a routine that I do every time before I play or anything like that. I do have a bunch of stuff that I sometimes just go to when I feel like I need to move my fingers a little bit before playing a gig or playing a rehearsal or even just practicing. So a warm-up is really for the ears and the fingers together. I'm gonna show you five warm-ups and let's just get right into it. So chromatic scale. Let me show you two ways you can do this. The first one is using open strings and basically staying in the first position, the first four frets. Okay, so. What I just did there is alternate picking. I'm gonna go for open E and then F on the first fret. F sharp, second fret. G, G sharp, fourth fret. So, all right. And then on the next string, we're gonna play open A. First fret, second fret, third fret, fourth fret, so. Same thing with the D string. Zero, one, two, three, four. Zero, one, two, three, four. On the G string as well, zero. One, two, three, four. And on the B string, no zero, just one. Straight from pinky on the G string, on the fourth fret, and first fret on the B string. If you play an open string on the B string as well, you're just gonna repeat the same note, which is B. So, B, C, C sharp, D, D sharp. So, zero, 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 one, two, three, four, zero. On the E string, one, two, three, four. Descending is, uh, it's looking like this. One, four, zero. Let me do descending one time slow. So that's the first way to play a chromatic scale. And the second way is the basically freeway, okay? It's the highway. You go down the neck if you want to or up a string. Okay, let me show you what I mean. So once you finish every grouping of four, I can go up with the index finger to the following note and then do a one, two, three, four from there. Basically, I can do the entire string. But if I wanna continue, I don't wanna get stuck here, then I have to switch strings and get all the way to the top. Let's say I wanna switch here, I go down a fret, and then one, two, three, four. down a fret, up on the string. And then when I want to switch from the G to the B, I don't switch a fret. And then between the B and the E I do. Okay, so here's another example. I'm gonna put the tabs for these on my Patreon, so go ahead and check it out. And let me know in the comments, what's your favorite warm-up? I wanna get inspired too. Warm-up number two is kind of advanced, but uh, it's good to work on. It's basically playing the major scales of all the keys, almost all over the neck, switching keys using the circle of fifth and the fourth, okay? So we're starting in C major. The lowest note is E. C major. F. B flat. 
E flats. A flats. D flats. G flats. B. on a PDF that is like just one example of this and if you feel comfortable you can um, switch whenever you want and wherever you want okay this warm-up is uh, a free flow and it's important to keep those in mind you don't want to use just um, warm-ups that are so methodical and repetitive and boring you want to warm up your brain and decision-making too and your musicality uh, when you warm up some exercises will have an element of freedom for you to choose and make decisions and that's a good thing okay warm-up number three uh, this one is a uh, scalier warm-up as well let's choose uh, the key of d flat major just because and uh, play this pattern basically from every note you start let's say it's the one note you go down a third back to the note, so and then up a third from every note you choose, you play that from the one, from the two from the three again, you can go up as much as you want. Okay, here we go. to warm up number four another pretty advanced one we're gonna play the triads of all the keys okay so we'll try we'll keep the metronome on let's do a little slower and play C major triad and go up the circle of fifth so Try 
Because they lose E Back to C. Try the triplets if you can. To F. B flat. That one is really, really good. Now for the last one, let's do um, pentatonic. Okay, pentatonic, basically in skipping notes. I'm playing a note and then I'm playing a note that is two away from that one, so not the next one. I'm not playing up the scale. I'm going for the first note to the third note, okay? From the second note to the fourth note third note to the fifth note from the fourth note to the next one so from the fifth note to the next two okay just keep skipping the notes I can go up the neck a little faster stay in the same position okay let's do uh, the next position next position Slow it down a little bit. Next position. position. And then back to the same position. Okay, these are the five warm-ups that I'm sharing this video. I'm going to do more and I need to practice those as well. So I'm glad I went over this. If you are still watching, so thank you very much. And if you want to reach out to me for any questions, you can comment below or DM me on Instagram. I appreciate you watching. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.